Afternoon, he led state police on a high speed chase in a stolen truck through the streets of Albuquerque, running more than a dozen red lights and driving on the opposite side of the road. Police say he admitted to being high on meth at the time. News 13 Stephanie Chavez has the state police dash cam. Crashed out right here, East Bunny Road. There's a guy, there's several people getting out of the vehicle. The chase concluded at eastbound Frontage Road and Southbound Road underneath the Big Eye after it crashed. It was lucky no one was injured. The person arrested, 19-year-old Dominic Cano. It all started just after 1 a.m. on November 22nd. The state police officer says he noticed the truck without its headlights on at Oak and Lead. The officer turned on his emergency lights on Interstate 25 and the truck took off. Speeds reached 104 miles an hour before the suspect exited the interstate. You can see on the dash cam video, the pickup truck starts to travel along frontage road and side streets reaching speeds of 90 miles an hour. The truck runs numerous red lights. Several times during the chase, the truck drives on the wrong side of the road. The officer even lost sight of the truck at one point. A couple of minutes later, the truck crashes into the concrete embankment that ended the chase. Get on the ground. Besides Kano, two other people were in the vehicle and took off, but were quickly caught. Kano was mumbling and could barely be understood, but did tell police he was on a three-day meth binge, and that was the reason he took off. Stephanie Chavez, KRQE News 13. Dominic Kano was released on his own recognizance, ordered to report to pretrial services. He failed to do so, so there is now a warrant out for his arrest.